The baddest woman on the planet is here. There is only one. Rowdy Ronda Rousey. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Listen to this place. They're going nuts. And if you ask me, the champ had better bring her A game tonight, regardless of whether the title's on the line or not. Don't you worry, Cole. I don't think she has anything other than an A game. If she does, I haven't seen it, that's for sure. action is underway and in this one I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen I'd just be ready for anything sometimes that's all you can do you know what I like about her she's approaching this match the same as she would if the title was on the line Sometimes you'll see a smile on Ronda Rousey's face, but that changes once she goes into combat mode, Corey. <laughs> Call the cops when Ronda's on the loose. She'll tell you she's not a wrestler or a fighter. Ronda's a martial artist. Her judo training means she puts out maximum efficiency with minimum effort. There's a philosophy, purpose, and direction in everything she does. Byron, Corey described Ronda's judo philosophy with her extensive combat background. How does her past translate to competition in WWE? Well, Rousey is learning that her skills can make her a dominant force in WWE, but she still has to remember that there are moves she's never felt in an octagon and rules that make those moves perfectly legal as well. Ronda Rousey got out of there in time. What a stomp! Good grief! This might be it! Oh my! Ronda Rousey got out of there in time! Boom! 
What a suplex. She's absorbing some offense here. But she knew this match wasn't going to be easy. Oof. Damn it. Boom, what impact. She's starting to falter here. Her hopes of winning this match may very well be in jeopardy. This might be one of the most tightly contested matches I've seen in a long time. Any one of these women can win this thing. Take it off her feet now. And you're not going to win many matches down there. I can tell you that. Whether it's in a ring, an octagon, or on the big screen, Ronda Rousey has truly embodied her nickname, the baddest woman on the planet. And that's a title she puts on the line every time she fights. Knee drop. Byron touched on Ronda Rousey's nickname as the baddest woman on the planet. Her Olympic, MMA, and WWE career certainly support the name that the public gave her, but it does put a huge target on her back. Yeah, but Rousey welcomes any challenge, Cole. 15 consecutive MMA victories, all by submission or knockout, all but... She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. Not even close. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Could have a stiff neck for a while. That has got to be it. Ronda Rousey got out of there in time. He escapes trouble there. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. She's looking at it. Frog splash! Give it five stars. This one is over. And she gets her shoulder up. Very admirable performance here, but you have to wonder if she's risking permanent injury. Gets out of the way of that one. Beautiful technique. Boom! <laughs> Ronda Rousey's done playing. Victory is on the horizon. She's a superstar on a mission. Oh man, she's rolling now. Ronda Rousey's done playing. Look at her go. In control. Oh, that'll mess up the neck. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a... She goes for the cover. Gets the shoulder up. Wow, what's it going to take? Wow, that's pure power, guys. Shoulder tackle. Hard landing there. Nothing to worry about. Just a little misstep on her part. Will it be? I think so. And a kick out. Not even close on that. It's going to take more than that. How much more punishment needs to be dished out? Just finish it! Her opponent is clearly getting the best of her here. Yeah, ooh, what impact. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Cover here. One, two, three! I don't believe it. The match is over. Here is your winner, Louis Vachon. Took it to another level to gain that win. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. And the crowd here tonight still in awe. in the morning. The following contest 
is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cocoa Beach, Florida, weighing in at 234 pounds, Rick the Model Martel. From Park Avenue to Milan, Italy, you will not find anyone like Rick Martel. I don't think I've ever seen someone who admires himself as much as the model Rick Martel does. Look at the jawline, Byron Saxton. You would admire yourself if you looked anywhere near as good as Rick Martel. And his opponent from Honolulu, Hawaii, weighing in at 235 pounds, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. One of the most decorated superstars in the history of sports entertainment. I'm talking former Intercontinental Champion, former WCW United States Champion, WCW Television Champion, even a Tag Team Champion. One of the best pure technicians to ever step between the ropes. The Dragon has arrived. Definitely an electric feeling to this venue tonight. Settle in, guys. This is going to be a blast Yikes. to watch. Oh, continuing to punish them. Close line. Oh, that'll leave a mark. Got him up. What a strike. Oh! Right to the back. What a stomp. Good grief. Ricky Steamboat starting to look a little oh, off his man. game. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get Man. out of hand. Harsh impact. Ooh, that'll mess up your shoulder. He's got him covered. And the kick out. Remarkable. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. He's starting to stagger a bit. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Ah, oh, the reversal by Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Corey, tell me, just how much strength is carrying your opponent around like this take? Let's put it this way, Cole. Saxton would never be able to do it. And Ricky the Dragon Steamboat reverses it. Bringing it back between the ropes. Vicious attack. There he goes, crashing to the floor. And he's heading back in. Ooh, what impact. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, my goodness. This hurts. Oh! Ricky Steamboat is playing mind games, but I'm not sure if it's the time for it. 
What a strike. Boom! <laughs> Rick Bartel, too quick. Ah, oh, the reversal by Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Shaking power slam. What a match! Rick Martell starting to look defeated out there. There's a good chance he can't recover from this. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Showing some quickness there. Nasty impact. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat looking a bit uneasy here. This very well may be too much for him to handle. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. He's going to want to make some changes if he wants to stay in it. Guys, at this point, I'd be shocked if his opponent is able to... Shoulders on the mat. One. And Steamboat easily avoids the pinfall. The Dragon refuses to be slain. Never say die. I don't know about you guys, but it looks to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. Ah, oh, damage to the body. Oh, that's unnecessary. Oh boy, he is rolling. You gotta believe this one's over. Steamboat in incredibly bad shape right now. He might just have nothing left to give, guys. WWE.com poll had him as the overwhelming favorite leading into this match, but he's definitely not running cross body by the model. This is his opportunity to win this thing. Three! Yes! Unreal performance. Let's take another look at these guys in action. Yeah, he's putting in the work. He's getting it done here. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. display tonight for Rick Martel. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. I couldn't agree more. What an amazing contest that was.
Yeah, now we're talking. And his opponent, representing the Steiner Brothers from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 275 pounds, Scott Steiner. I'm all for tough competition, but this one likes to take things too far. Their matches can be downright gruesome sometimes, the way they go after their opponent. This industry isn't about being gentle, Saxton. You have to be a little mean sometimes to ensure the win. If anything, I think the intensity can be turned up in the ring. This match has everyone backstage buzzing. He is an exciting competitor to watch. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. But he'll be in for a long night at the office facing Shelton Benjamin. Over the years, we've seen Shelton beat the unbeatable. Shelton's outfits may have changed, the hair might be gone, but the skills just as sharp as they've ever been. Yeah, Shelton may not be as fast as he used to be, but he can still grapple with the best of them. That's why they call him the Gold Standard. He's got him down. Is this it? Kick out before the one count. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. He catches Shelton with a counter. Got to find a way to get out of this. And uncanny to the cover. Gets the shoulder. Wow. What's it going to take? He's far from finished. Paying it right back with a reversal. Ah, oh, gets cracked by the overhand. What are the keys to victory for Shelton Benjamin here tonight? Shelton really can do it all, but his power and technique have always been key. This guy trained with Brock Lesnar in college and was mentored by the Hall of Famer Kurt Angle earlier in his WWE career. That's where his bread's butter. Stop fighting yet. Belly to belly suplex. Off into the pin. Two count. No shoulders up at two. This could be a tipping point in this match. strong enough. You can feel him desperately trying to find a way, and he does. Oh, look at this power. This is unholy. Look at that for <laughs> reps. <laughs> that is something else. Oh, landing. Oh, man. Look out. Explorer suplex. So crisp from Benjamin. So to the match.
is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Hagerstown, Maryland. Weighing in at 178 pounds. The Cruiserweight Wrestling Champion, Scotty Briggs. Looking out at the countless members of the WWE Universe in attendance, they are all here because of matches like this one. his focus 100% of the time. That's why he's the champion. This competitor tonight. You know he understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make big headway on the roster. And he'll be facing off against Rob Van Dam. Hopefully he's done his homework and can hang. And he goes for the pin. And he manages to kick out in one. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. Oh. Nice drop kick, so precise. And set him up. Oh, I need him here. That's gonna hurt. RBD keeps him at bay. Drop kick. Looking at Rob Van Dam's options here. Corey, how do you think he can take control of this match? I think RBD needs to make this his kind of match. Climb the ropes. Get extreme. From the middle rope. Brent taking rope shoulders down. This could be it. Not getting the two at this point has got to say something. RVD fires back. He's got him down. Is this it? And he breaks the count quickly. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Seated drop kick. Headed to the top now. From the top. Diving low drop from the top rope. Goes into the pin. And a shoulder in the air. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Whoa, not quite yet. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. He forces a break before the count. Of oh no, getting in position. What's he planning to do here? The official asking him, is he gonna tap? Is he gonna tap out? He's trying to hold on, but for how long? And he very quickly counters. That's how you impress. Oh, man, you can see he is feeling it now. That'll turn your lights out. Oh, costly error there. Heading up, he's thinking big. From the heavens, big time splash. Got the knees up just in time. Flying with the moonsault. Cover. Is it enough? He's able to beat a two count. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. RVD up the turnbuckles. 
And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. From the top! No, 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 no! Moved out of the way! Yeah. Van Dam was scouted there. Reversal on top of reversal. Oh, no! Straight oh. across the top rope. Producing a trampoline. been put on the defensive. Oh my god. Tommy Moonsault. Is it enough? The cover. All the move bouncing off the road. He switches it back around. Oh my god. And DDT. Spike them. Carefully plays stomp to the arm. Van Dam saves himself. Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. Countered it just in time. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. Two, three, no. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. Is he willing to endure in this match? Big move, but it's still unable to end this. Oh, oh my gosh! He reverses it. Oh my god, the springboard attack fails to land. He's been placed in the corner now. Getting that shoulder up now is huge. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. From the top! He misses the target. Short flight, but a rough landing. Incoming! Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Oh! He's looking a little weary now. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Oh, that might have just broken something. You know, here, Corey, getting it cinched in. Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. Slipped right underneath, and just like that, he's out of the hole. Big kick. Four. And the boom! Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Six. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Oh, what a kick. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. Oh, my God. A boom salt. Into the cover. Oh. oh, my God. He's still in the match. He got the shoulder up right at the last moment. Move right there. Attempting high risk move after high risk move at a breakneck pace. <laughs> nice arm drag. RVD just getting knocked around. Yeah, RVD needs to find that spark. I think we know what's coming next. From the middle rope, breathtaking hurricane run. RBD 
RVD looking to get back in this. It's time for RVD to gain control after his opposition's mistake. And he's showcasing some dominance here. It's been a smothering attack keeping him ahead. Uh-oh. Way too high. be huge, I can tell you that a loss would be absolutely devastating. Given the competition right now, a loss tonight would be a huge setback. And their opponent, accompanied by W, and at a combined weight of 636 pounds, Cowboy Stan Hansen, and the King. Guys, we have a big time tag team match coming up here. A big time match with big time stakes, Michael. Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. And we're now underway with this huge tag team match. Oh, man. Tag team action in full effect, guys. And these superstars are about to show all you folks what it's all about. Impact. Here's your tag. These two aren't done. Kick. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, the arm's trapped. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. 
In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. Oh, here it comes! Spiked! Sit out! Pile driver! Comes in off the tag. Nailed it. Not today. He looks a bit off his game here. His tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kobe Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record-setting 483 days. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. with a face buster. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. He's still got plenty of gas left in his tank, though. It's no secret that quick oh. tags lead to success in the tag team division. And I'd say the quicker he can make that tag here, the better their chances of winning will be. Yeah, but he's still in considerably better Ooh. overall shape than his opponent right now. I mean, it seems to me like he still has plenty of fight left in him. Really working over the body. Oh, a debilitating elbow drop. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. A boot. Oh, no, no. Oh, just inflicting so much damage to the body. No, he reverses it. Holy. Here he goes. This just ain't going to do it. Whoa, he, he works his way out. A bit of a Houdini job right there. When this guy's on, look out. 
What a strike. Right on the mark. A great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkel, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. The wind up and the pitch. Uppercut. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, and... He's looking at it. Dominating crossbody. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Wow, the referee might want to think about stopping this match. What's he doing? Got him up. Talk about dismantling your opponent. The end may be near, folks. At this point, his confidence has to be at zero. He's running on fumes right now. It might be smart for him to make a tag. You'd have to think his partner has a little more gas in the tank. I don't think there are two teams I'd rather see. You gotta believe this one's over. To think, I almost wrote him off earlier. Look at this. Boom! <laughs> what a brutal beating we've seen dished out so far here tonight. Tagged in. I don't know about you guys, but it looks to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Dodges that one. for the exclamation point. You gotta believe this one's over. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. Bodies are not supposed to bend that way. Wait, he broke out of it. Cole, how in the world did he find the energy to do that? Oh, nasty impact. Victory is on the horizon. What a clothesline! Ouch. That should do it. Showing some quickness there. The intensity of this match has been incredible. Taking on any more damage here could very well mean the beginning of the end. Jaw-shattering boot. Oh, he dodges out of the way. He gets it with a reversal. Just a step quicker, it looks like. Nailed it. Whoa. 
Gets out of the way of that one. What a match this has been, guys, and it's starting to look like these superstars are beginning to feel the effects. In off the tag. Got to get back in the ring. We might just have a count out on our hands, Cole. How are these superstars even still going, guys? I mean, they have to be on fumes right now. Boom! <laughs> In off the tag. Instinct. That's the only thing keeping these teams standing at this point. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Counter here. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Look out, look out. This could be, this might be it. Oh, my. This is his opportunity to win this thing. That was both a quick and powerful strike, guys. Oh, no, no. Oof. The cover. One. And he got a near fall out of it. Wow. That's pure power, guys. Keep your eye on this one. Looking for a repeat. Oh, guys, there's the... Here we go. We knew this was coming. Impact. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Boom, right in the button. You can bet he's going to feel that in the morning. Oh, yeah. He's too quick for him there. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, he's able to reverse it. Oh, what impact. Looks to me like these superstars are running on fumes right about now. Beautiful technique. Can he score the pin? Oh, maybe. Oh, that was a close call. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. He looks for it once again. Oh, nasty impact. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Here we go. We knew this was coming. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Showing off some of his speed there. Chop block from the front. Big time takedown right there. This might just be it for him, Michael. Oh, his feet are on the ropes. His feet are on the ropes. I expected as much from him tonight. And he got a near fall out of it. This is amazing. Got the reversal. Oh, he's such a tough target. Uh oh. Scoop slam. Setting up in the beautiful technique. Tagged in. He's so close to making... Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. He's making a statement here with this attack. him down hard. You gotta love that kind of aggression. Here he goes. 
Oh, what a nasty knee lift. We may be looking at our winner here, guys. Here we go. We knew this was coming. Hooked up. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. One more look at it. Dominating cross body. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Two. Three. And we have our winners. How about another look at some of the highlights? Almost forgot about this one. He ain't messing around. He ain't playing here. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here. Here are your winners, Cowboy Stan Hansen and The King. Big pitfall victory here tonight. What we just saw there was a doctorate class in tag team competition. They just took the game to a whole other level. Folks, we just saw one of the most exciting matches you'll see anywhere.